Hey guys, welcome back. Tell you what, uh, we're inside tonight, guys. Uh, I tried to film over the weekend and the weather kind of got it, hit me a little bit, so got delayed till today and uh, just gonna do a little indoor cook with some chicken thighs, but uh, that's not what we're gonna be looking at real close. It's at the store the other day and I seen some of this Louisiana Fish Company's air fryer, uh, chicken coat batter, coating, whatever. Uh, and I just wanted to give it a try. I've never tried it before and bring you along with us. Let's get going. Okay, over here I got uh, four. They're actually pretty good sized chicken thighs. Uh, we'll see what's gonna happen. We're just going by the directions. It says I can do an egg wash. Uh, I'm not prepared to do that at the moment, but it also says you can just use some ice cold water. I have some cold water here and the batter and it smells phenomenal. And let's get going. Dip it in the water. Come over here in our batter. Coat her up real good. Bo's trying to run away. Right, we'll set that there just to chill out. I'll get the rest of these done and get back to you. All right, guys. Let this chill out for a second. We'll get this in the air fryer. Hey, guys, I got my crisper basket here. I'm gonna spray the basket just to try to prevent some uh, sticking. This is just Pam cooking spray, the original. Here, it's gonna get dirty. I'm also gonna hit the tops of these just to give them a little oil. And we're just gonna place them in a crisper tray. I'm gonna turn them over so I can spray the tops of them. And let's hit the tops of these. All right, I hope you can see this. I've preset my machine up here. It's on the air fry setting. Got it at 375 degrees. I'm setting it for 20 minutes, but I have a feeling the size of these thighs and of some of our weather conditions, I'll probably go over that, but we'll check it. So we'll check temps as we go to show your inside. Uh, I know in the Emerald 360 world there is a controversy about whether you leave in a drip tray or not just your drip tray but your baking pan for cleanup. Uh, I'm gonna try it within just to see what happens. Let's get this thing preheated. All right guys, we are preheated. Right in here and just let her go. I'll probably check this in about 15, 10, 15 minutes uh, just to see how we're doing. I'll bring you back then. Okay guys, I'm gonna pause this for a minute. We're roughly about 14 minutes in. I just wanna get some checks on some temps and see how we're doing. Oh, whoops, we got a ways to go, I can tell. Definitely tell, yeah, yeah, we're barely at 100. <laughs> 120, stay off the bone, Rogers, yeah. Okay guys, yeah, definitely some more time. I'm gonna set this for another 15 minutes and see where we are. See you in 15 minutes. All right, guys, let's see what we got here. We are about 30 minutes into this. Let's see what we got. No, I'm gonna need a little bit more time on that. I'm actually gonna turn these and let them go another 10 minutes. 
me set these over here. Getting that nice golden brown color. Hey right, guys, I'm gonna do the same thing for about 10 more minutes. Make an adjustment here. We are, I find it hard to believe that we are not done at this point. We are done. Definitely 180, yeah. We went over what I was going for. <laughs> it's alright, looks good though. Alright guys, let's get these out of here. And I'll plate them up and we'll get this thing a taste test for you. Would you look at that beautiful thing? Man. Kind of golden brown that is. That looks delicious, guys. All right, let's go in here. Mm -hmm. That's what we showed up for, was the seasoning tonight. I love my chicken thighs. If you watch this channel long enough, you know that, that and wings. Wow, that is delicious. This is the Louisiana Fish Fry Company. Their air fryer uh, coating mix for chicken. So yeah, let me get another bite here. I like that flavor. They don't, you can tell it's a Louisiana. <laughs> it's got a little little bite, but it's it's not hot. It's just got a little spice to it. Really good. Mmm. Oh yeah, guys. Uh, wow, I've never tried this before. It is delicious. I do recommend it. Um, I don't do many just really reviews on seasonings and stuff, but I might in the future. What do you think? Should I do more? Let me know down below in the comments. So guys, thank you guys. Uh, this is delicious. Uh, uh, we'll be doing more of these maybe. If I see some products out there that I haven't tried before, I might just pick them up and do some different little cooks for you. So again, thanks so much. Uh, we will see you on the next video, girls. God bless ya. Bye-bye.